Hell Divers, welcome back to a brand new update video. And we have just seen the brand new War Bond, which is coming on May 9th. I am really excited for this one. It looks like a whole new theme and uh, we're going to be going through all of the news in today's video. If you guys are as hyped as me, make sure to smash a like on today's video if you enjoy and consider subscribing to the channel for your daily Helldivers news. And let's get in with the video. So as you'll be able to see on your screen, Super Earth High Command has approved the deployment of a new war bond codenamed Polar Patriots on May 9th. With the cold steel of new weapons in hand, deliver a, fur, a, 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 flur, a flurry <laughs> of freedom via an avalanche of airstrikes to our enemies. They then go on to say the Polar Patriots war bond includes three new primary weapons armors, capes, and emotes, as well as one times new secondary weapon, grenade, and utility booster. Reminder, war bonds are not time limited. Once you buy it, you reap the rewards whenever you like. Stay frosty, hell divers. Now, if we come over now to the official PlayStation blog, we can check, uh, we can watch the trailer together, check out the new items. So it says new hell divers to war bond brings trap laying weaponry, arctic themed armor and more may 9th so polar patriots also comes packed with new emotes capes and sidearms so valiant warriors of justice a deep freeze is coming to the galaxy super earth leaders are deploying the next helldivers 2 premium war bond on may 9th to all fearless frontline forces codename polar patriots Overflowing with all new gear, this package of petrified, um, well, I'm not even going to pronounce that, features weapons, armor, capes, and emotes, so stay frosty in the roaring heat of battle as you ice the enemies of freedom. So, let's watch the trailer together and, uh, and see what it's like. So... Very random part of the video while you're watching the trailer in the background is I had just uploaded this video but completely forgot that Sony will copyright everything, which is fair enough. Um, so I'm just here to say hello to you guys while you're watching the trailer in the background. Um, and I hope it's I hope that your day's going well. I hope you're enjoying whatever's whatever you whatever you're up to and you're looking at the new war bond. Um, have did you have a nice Tuesday? Um, don't really know what else to say here. Just look at those cool weapons in the background um and yeah thanks sony for making you remove my video um yeah i'm just gonna sit here and just uh watch a trailer of you um anyway catch you guys in a bit um enjoy the rest of the trailer and i don't know why i'm speaking so quietly So yeah, that is the new war bond coming to the game. And there are some really cool weapons in here that I liked from it. We've got new capes, so much other stuff um, in this patch. So let's read through it. So it's time to thrill and chill Helldivers. Firepower. So the R61 Tenderizer, that sounds like an interesting weapon. A real tentacle terror. This high caliber assault rifle has awesome stopping power, but limited magazine size. So make sure each shot counts. Um, and uh, banter shots are not advisable. Um, we have the SMG 72 Pamela. A slower rate of fire than your other SMGs, but these concussive rounds will leave your enemies dazed confused and still very ugly good things come to hell divers who wait we have the plaz 101 purifier set the trap hold the trigger let them charge at you smile they're getting closer smile again closer smile closer smile closer <laughs> and release the trigger um and uh and the longer you can hold your nerve the trigger the bigger the damage so yeah that we saw that in the trailer that one looks really cool Looks like you can take down uh, walkers pretty easily too. Um, secondary weapons, we have the utility booster. So we have the G13 incendiary impact. Don't waste time reading the instructions. Lob it at the enemy and run. This thing detonates on impact and ignites the area. Um, and uh, so make sure your ally, uh, make sure you and your allies are not standing around having a chat. Then we have the P113 verdict. 
The, the guys in R&D love this one. Gas operated semi-automatic and chambers the largest center fire cartridge of any Lun pistol of its kind. Rapid, uh, well, yeah, so, they, they, wait, have they not got, oh, I really want to see this picture again. Should we go to the trailer? I really want to see this pistol. Is it, uh, uh, there was the grenade and then the pistols usually, uh, have they not got the one of the pistol? Or did, did we just see in the trailer or is it before the grenade? Oh, I don't know if there's one in the trailer. Oh, no, wait. There it is. That is That looks really, really cool. Um, and then um, the, we have motivational shocks. Literally shocks Helldivers back into action after being hit and slowed by sneaky, unjust attacks like the revolting bug acid vomit. Won't help you much with area, affected, uh, uh, area effects like EMS strikes, though. Now the new armor. We have the CW36 Winter Warrior. Blend into snowy environments with perfect camouflage. The enemy, enemy will never see you coming until it's far too late. Ah, the sweet smell of stealth. Passive boost. Serve assisted. Then we have the CW22 Kodak. Uh, Kodiak. Um, so thoroughly pressure tested by patriotic volunteers as part of the test subjects for Super Earth Citizen Advancement Program. Their sacrifice shall not be forgotten. It's passive boost fortified. Then we have the CW4 Arctic Ranger, features a nifty utility belt, boosting handy pockets that can be filled with a number of things, pocket knives. Oh wait, are we going to be able to use a pocket knife? Or, or is it just going to be there for the look? Oh, that would be so nice because we've been wondering about, uh, we've been wondering about more melee weapons in the future, but yeah, there's the pockets. Um, then we have the capes, so uh, the nightmare cape, scientifically proven to be terrifying. Um, that looks cool. Pinions of Everlasting Glory, Order of the Venerated Ballot. Um, and then, yes, of course, new emotes. We know our brave heroic soldiers like to bust out and move right in the middle of ferocious battles, no matter the deadly risk. So rock out um, and uh, request incoming call with the Helldivers for search for new voters with distribute ballots. So yeah, no, really cool. Um, Polar Patriots is rolling out to your destroyers on um, May 9th. Keep your call, drop the temperature and drop some ice cold justice out there, Helldivers. See you on the planet side. So... Yeah, I'm really, really looking forward to this brand new uh, premium war bond. Um, I'm going to be purchasing it as soon as it um, opens up for us to be able to do on May 9th. And I will show off some of the coolest weapons for you guys. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much all to cover in today's video. Um, a little update saying uh, from Spit saying Joel has a Discord account and he is in here, but he must be protected. So... Is Joel watching us more than we even realize? That's something else to uh, keep an eye out for, Hell Divers. But anyway, thank you for watching today's video. Let's go um, cause some more damage to the bots and the bugs in preparation for the release of the May 9th Warbond. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys very soon.